We haven't had internet all day. Some crackhead somewhere in the area messed up the fiber. After editing all day, I just want to play some Star Wars. But usual asshole isn't here. Which usual asshole? The one we started this Let's Play with oh, over that, a year ago. That usual asshole. Yeah, that usual asshole. Who do you want? Who do you want to be? Anakin or Obi Wan? Oh, we're gonna flip a coin. Heads, Anakin. Tails, Obi Wan. But heads is higher. High ground. Okay, heads, Obi Wan. Tails, <coughs> Anakin. Heads. Mm -hmm. Wait, which is heads? <laughs> they both have heads. <laughs> so heads, it was. Yes. You get to be Obi Wan. <laughs> yes. I get to be Anakin. Hooray! Just like last time. That is pretty solid. I get to fight Dooku. You get to fight Grievous. I get to fight Windu. Then I also. Damn, Anakin has way more boss battles. Oh, good. That's good. <laughs> what are we gonna call this? Nice. <laughs> this game technically came out before the movie, so playing this was kind of like a sneak peek of the movie. But it follows the movie pretty faithfully. It adds in a couple extra levels there. I mean, yeah, you gotta fluff it up a bit. But the levels actually make sense and they don't feel like just forced in horse crap. You know what I don't get? It says there are heroes on both sides. What does that mean? Where? Uh, fourth line. There are heroes on both sides. What does that mean? This game is the only reason I even have my Xbox 360 still. And also, they didn't show all the movie scenes like they would cut out certain scenes in the cutscenes. Boy, the I was watching Jeremy uh, talk about this game. I mean, this movie. Yeah. And he was just ragging on shit about this. The opening scene and then the eventual, like, fight scene. He's like, this shit takes too long. And it's like, it might take too long, but it's still fucking cool. I know. It's like, what did you want? More of them sitting around with the space monks moping and about crap? Like, this is why people like the prequels, this kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay, so, like... You got force, you know, because you can see those. Thanks for the tip, master. There's one thing I do like about this game, though, is Anakin's grunt noises. I'm gonna see if I can get it. Oh, listen. Oh! <laughs> there's another one to where uh, he goes, Oh! Good advice. I do not like the fixed angle though. Here. Yeah. There is a nice little feature I like in this game. An SPD. That is one weird, weird fucking. Well, I'll show you if I can get hurt at some point. That is some weird fucking, like, guard that he has. That? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, is there a rating system? What? It keeps saying fair. Yeah. Why is there a rating system? What are they rating? I don't know. Oh, like if you combo shit, I guess. Ah, okay. I guess I could always I mean, show you later, but uh, there's a feature I like in this game. If I can get shot a bunch, but Obi Wan's gonna cut him up. Yeah. I wouldn't. I wouldn't worry about it. You can show me later. Actually, I can just show you now. It doesn't even really matter. But I can. You can heal yourself using the Force. Oh, cool. Yeah. Because you can actually upgrade your abilities in this game. Because this is actually a pretty solid movie game. Hmm. Like, I'm like one of the few people that actually misses, like, movie games. So whenever I saw there was a Zombieland 2 video game, I'm like, um, what? There is? But then it turned out to be... Mobile game, didn't it? No, it's on, it's on console. Oh. Because, remember we went into, uh, Vintage Stock and we saw... Oh, yeah, it? that's right. Yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, watch if I get hit by the lightning. Ooh! Come on, do the noise. 
Do the noise. Okay, he won't do it. We must use the force to move this wreckage. This debris is too heavy. I can't lift it alone. There's no such thing as heaviness or size when using the force, fucker. <laughs> I'm just surprised he didn't say Anakin, press the force button. Because <laughs> I actually like that is the video game logic to where they talk like they're in a video game. Use mix heavy or light attacks. Ugh. Where's the back to tank at? There it is. There is a feature in this game that I know you are going to love. Oh? You will know it once you see it. Oh? Something that was gravely missing from uh, Fallen Order. Uh... You'll see it. I think it... <laughs> their lips. Yeah, their lips. Just. Did I get hurt from my own jump? Uh. I'm, if I'm gonna be frank, probably not too much editing will be done yeah. on these videos because. Oh, son of a bitch. Did they use a proper lotto technique? Lockout tagout technique? Oh, <laughs> shut up. You know we're getting a new lockout tagout technique at work? Yeah. Uh, I was voicing my opinion on it. How it should be done. What? Let's not talk about work on this. I, I read the thing, but I didn't really read it. If I'm being honest. You know what, fuck it, we can talk about it. So at our work, we work on planes. If you're working in the cockpit and you need to pull like a, a fuse or whatever, you gotta do this process called log out tag, log out, lock eh. out, lock out, tag out. <sighs> yeah. Going. Watch those snipers. I can oh. this. What was what was the thing saying that? What was that piece of paper saying? That we're, what are we changing? Okay, so instead of filling out a book for a specific tag, the actual tag itself will have a piece of paper on it. Oh, that that's dumb, if I'm being honest. Oh yeah, no, and there's only like four or five slots on it. But, you know, people have been messing up. They haven't been filling out their junk at work. Yeah, that's just... Ugh. But enough of that. Yeah. Use combination attacks against those super battle droids. Okay, fine. These droids never learn. I don't think so. Clumsy machine. That'll help. <laughs> and the way they got these uh, levels set up is to where it does jump between Anakin and Obi Wan. Huh. I mean, I'm going to be honest, it's not Witcher 3, like, well, no. I mean, we said this before, but it's not Witcher 3, but nice movement is pretty good. Oh, yeah, this came out in, like, 2004. Yeah. There, there we go. Let's get moving. The Chancellor's waiting. We can handle this, R2. You stay here with the ships. Do you get experience points and you can level it into stuff? I see, I see. Now, does this apply to both characters? No, this? just uh, the character you're playing it. Oh, so you build your own character as you how you want it, kind of. Yeah. Huh. Or you could build Obi Wan different. This one is Obi Wan, but before we do that, let me see how this came out. <laughs>